Welcome to Stone Magpie for me to show you what's inside the packet on my table. I am excited. It has come all the way from France and it is a bit of a treat. Let's open up the packet. Lovely little sticker, by the way, saying handmade. And I'll tell you more about it. I'm opening it this way because there are address details on the back um, for where this has come from. Inside, I'll have to try and open it like this. We have a pouch and a card. And I wanted to show you this because this is where this pen is from and as I say, it is French, so pardon my French on this, literally. <laughs> I'm not a French speaker. C'est plus beau à tour. C'est plus beau à tour. So a lovely little gift card in the package. As you can see, it is Etsy, Facebook and Instagram where this seller is. And look, thank you. Lovely touch there. It is a lovely velvet pouch. Oh, I am excited. I can already see <laughs> that this has my favourite multi-placer end on it, which is a four-placer. And let me just go and get my usual diamond pen. You may well recognise this from my videos. I use it all the time. And look, the end is quite nibbled. I still haven't filed it, which one of my viewers suggested that I do. I haven't tried that yet. So I'm really pleased that my new pen, ta-da, is the same. That's even more exciting. Now, I, I do use this, as I say, all the time because I like to tell people that it's okay to use the basic pens that come with the kit. They are perfectly fine and really easy to use. However, sometimes we just want a treat. I'm really excited to unpackage it and show you the pen itself. It's quite chunky, so it's taking a bit of pushing getting out of this pouch. Oh, 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 look. Oh, oh, that's so pretty. So we've got a usual diamond nib at the end. The tips, should I say? I always call them nibs, but officially they're called uh, tips. So we've got the single placer at one end and this lovely multi placer at the other. And it's a resin pen with purple and green swirls with glitter inside. And then at this end, we have got little dried flowers. I'll turn it slowly so you can see. Look at that little yellow one there. Oh, it's so pretty. Turn. I hope that you can see those really clearly. See if I can get any closer without blurring. Oh, and I don't know about you, but I think these swirls, the purple, whites and greens, look quite cloud-like. Oh, it's gorgeous. Look at this flower coming up here. Oh... Now this seller does sell on Etsy, as I said. However, I got this on what they call a Facebook drop. So if you go to the Facebook page, you'll see sometimes listings. There's usually about 16 in a listing and um, there's one of two ways. Your name can either be pulled out of a hat when you put in which pen you would like, which is what happened with me for this one or they do the Facebook drop on Etsy and you really have to race to it when the time, <laughs> when it goes up on the listing and it's just first come first serve for these beautiful pens and they are different shapes. I liked this one because I thought one end 
dips in and the other one dips out so it's got like um, two different types of roundness at the end. It's a really nice weight to it. It's not really light but it's not heavy either. <gasps> Look it's just gorgeous. I'm seeing different things every time I look at this pen. The swirls, the flowers, oh, it's just beautiful. As I say, it is a treat. This one, 31 pounds, but we all need beautiful things in our life sometimes, don't we? And this is probably the start of my collection of beautiful diamond painting pens. Don't we deserve it? Yes, we do. <laughs> So you'll probably see me working with this one and this one and probably my other chunky resin one with the claw. This seller also does sell the steel tips as well, which I've not tried before. But watch this space because I am keen to give those a go as well. I really hope that you've enjoyed seeing this beautiful pen. Have a look at this seller and see what you think see if you agree have a look at the different shapes i think it's really interesting we've got like these ribs on as well um, and they are handmade hand turned resin diamond painting pens thank you nicholas for your hard work making this pen i'm thrilled thank you all for joining me today do catch me on instagram stone magpie 11 or join in the community page it's on the youtube community tab, leave comments and I'm going to put a survey on there very soon. So I'll see you there. Take care everyone. Bye for now. Bye.